subscribe to my channel and press the bell icon to get the early notification of my latest video. Hello and welcome back. In today's video we will see best adapter Wi-Fi settings. Wi-Fi adapter not only receives wireless signals, it can also transmit signals for notebook, smartphone, iPad and so on. And you will know how to set up your Wi-Fi on your desktop PC, how to install its software, how to find out whether it is properly connected to the USB drive. Wi-Fi adapter can be connected to either USB 2 or USB 3 drive. Then how to connect to your Wi-Fi username, check your broadband speed and also find out how the broadband speed can be increased. And what can be done when PC is not getting connected to Wi-Fi. Here I have bought a simple generic Wi-Fi adapter from local market. You can also buy online on websites like Amazon. It has frequency range from 2.4 to 2.48 GHz and wireless speed up to 1200 mAh. This adapter is very tiny in size. It comes with small CD drive having installation software for setting up network. Pressing Windows plus X key and opening device manager. In device manager we have to look in network adapters. A already network driver is installed that is connected through Ethernet cable to the Wi-Fi router. Now connecting wireless USB adapter to the USB drive. After connecting you can see the page has refreshed. And in other device we can see 802.11n which is a specification for wireless LAN and also indicates that device is connected. Right clicking on new device and choosing from update driver software. Next we can find two options where windows will automatically search for updated driver software or you can choose to browse from computer and install the driver software which comes with the Wi-Fi adapter. By clicking on search automatically it will automatically search for the driver online or you can choose other option now browse my computer for driver software as I have already got the driver software therefore choosing second option of browse my computer for driver software and installing it either from the hard drive or DVD drive after installation is over you can see the driver is installed as it is showing here in order to check whether the wireless driver is working it is recommendable to disable the driver link with the router. You can disable from here or in network connections. Press Windows and X and go to network connections. Disabling the earlier network connection with Ethernet cable icon. Other is Wi-Fi wireless LAN connection. Connecting from here did not work. Moving down below towards the right corner. Wi-Fi signal icon can be seen. When I clicked on it, I could see my connection username and also other Wi-Fi signals within my locality. Click on connect then enter your network security key. Enter next. You can choose the recommended option as yes. Then it will start verifying and connecting and within very few seconds the network connection is established. Now it can be seen that internet is working. Some important notes. Checking connection speed. You can check speed from various websites. You may get a little or more less speed depending upon variety of reasons. Here for example for 30 Mbps plan I am getting up to 12 Mbps speed. Tip number one is that if your wireless adapter is connected to USB 2 port you can disable or eject your Wi-Fi adapter then take it out from USB 2 port and put it in USB 3 port. Then again enable the Wi-Fi connection and then check the internet speed. As you can see here clearly that internet speed has increased to 29 Mbps which is much better than before. Another important tip is when your network connection seems ok but still internet is not working then you can right click on Wi-Fi wireless connection and select the diagnose option which will verify and fix the internet connection and set it working.